So for completing this project, first of all, I have to install required plugin on my server. Now I'm going to install first Astra theme. So if I go to dashboard and hover over appearance, then themes, click on add new. And you can simply type here Astra. But uh, without typing, you can also uh, view the Astra theme from dashboard here. If you click on popular, you will be able to see Astra also. But I already typed here and here you can see the Astra theme. Now I'm going to click on install and click activate. Now the Astra theme is activated. So if you do not want to use Stata template, you can simply close this one. But if you want to use Stata template, you can click get started. For this tutorial, I'm not going to use Stata template. In another video, I will be showing you how to use Astra Stata template and how to make website within very short time. And it will save you a lot of time. Let's close this one. And go to plugins then click add new i'm going to install elementor type here elementor click install now and also i want to use essential add-ons for elementor which is also free and it will allow us to use some of the add-ons from them and which is very helpful for our design so let's install this one after installing this plugin, I will be activate them together from plugins directory. The installation is complete. Now I'm going to click on installed plugins and activate both of them. So there are a couple of steps that you can follow or you can escape here. So I'm not going to follow them at this moment. And I will just you can always come back here later but there are another plugin that I have to install I'm going to click add new here and type here WP forms click install now and click activate now it will take us to the landing page or the land page for WP forms so here you can see the tutorial and other things that they recommend for their product but we'll be taking a look uh, on all of this later uh, not right now so if i click on dashboard and if you want to view our website how it looks it looks like this on the next part i will be completing header and footer and also there are some styles and typography that uh, this typography and color i'll be configuring on the next video